Hello, my name is Pamela Powers. Today's video is a little bit different. Instead of a commentary about the news, it's an announcement. As many of you know, I served Legislative District 9 in Tucson in the Arizona House for six years and recently retired in January 2023. When I retired, many of my constituents asked me if I would ever consider holding political office again. And I said, maybe something local, right? And so now an opportunity has presented itself for a local office, and that is that Steve Kazachik recently resigned from his Ward 6 City Council seat as of March 31st, and the City Council has set up a process for an appointment for somebody who lives in Ward 6 to fulfill the rest of his term, which goes through 2025. And so yesterday, April 2nd, I submitted my letter of interest and my resume for this appointment. And I hope that you all will support me also in this appointment. I'm going to be sending out information how you can do that. You can obviously share this video, talk to your friends. You could send a letter or an email to the mayor and council and the clerk of court saying that you support me for the appointment. Uh, you can write letters to the editor lots of different things. Do your own social media about it. Anyway, I think that I would be a welcome addition and maybe a useful addition to the city council because I have a long background in management, uh, public relations and communications. And I think one of the things that Kazachek and I have in common was that we have been known for communicating with our constituents. My little desktop videos from the Capitol were very popular. You could see those desktop videos from a city council person in the future if you support me for this appointment. Communicating with you and doing videos and explaining tough issues, that's how I do public service. That's what I did in the legislature and that was what I would do on the city council. And so I hope you'll support me in this. Uh, the people don't get to vote. There will be a public forum on April 23rd where uh, some number of candidates will be asked to answer questions. You do have the opportunity to submit questions by April 12th. In my social media, I'll talk about how you can submit letters of support and how you can submit the questions because bring it on, let's have some good questions. Let's have questions about housing and the environment and water and homelessness. The city's doing a pretty good job, but there's also a lot of issues that they're going to be facing in the future. And it's good for you all to know how the appointees would feel about these different issues. So anyway, please support me for this and thank you very much for listening.